Welcome back everybody, some more Everybody's Golf on PlayStation 4. Uh, Green Country Club again today, all 18, but I'm going to play Long Tees Teeny Cups, which stand the clubs. So this should be slightly harder um, than what we'll get, because I've got slightly better clubs, but I'm going to play it slightly longer. You'll get fixed skill in the qualifier, which is about level 20 power. So I figure if I play off Long Tees, it should be a touch harder. We'll see how we get on as well. I also haven't set a score for this, and I didn't really want to play regular teeny all week. It'll get boring, and then when it comes to the weekend, I'll have lost my edge. So, um, 120 left. Bit of wind, but nothing, nothing major. Probably do need a little bit more club. So one of the things I'm sort of working on at the moment is trying to figure out how much more you need for the wind. The answer is not quite that much. Quite a bit of putting practice always welcomes. We've got a nine footer. Can't hit it super firm. Oh, just crept him. So we've got a birdie. Yeah, I've played the nine, but I haven't played the 18. I eagle. Uh, I can say you eagle. It's a part. With the custom clubs, you could definitely get it up there. So a bit like yesterday, this is all about getting it up to the corner. Oh, missed it. This has gone left. Where's it gone? I think it's all right. I'm a long way out, but I've got a shot. Trying to play the flyer, get a little bit of length on it. We're going to come up short, but that's okay. Could do with the chip in practice. Cool. Sometimes it's good to kind of just put it in random spots and just see how you're going to play it. Get your eye in. Rather than always assuming you'll put it in position A every time. Because you certainly will not put it in position A. That was always going to be short, wasn't it? But I quite fancy a bit of putting practice on these. One of the things I find is sometimes you don't play enough putts on these greens to really get a read. Which is probably why playing it a little bit longer probably helps me. So this is going to be downwind. Yeah, my 4 iron's so underpowered. We might, I might as well power the 4 iron up. Might as well. Gonna need it eventually. I mean, not in this tournament, obviously, because you'll get fixed clubs. But while I'm here, I'm just get a bit of power on it. And give myself a bit of putt in practice. So powered it up, got a nice long putt. Looks like it slopes up. No, you're right, Breaking Suzuki. Hmm. About there. there. It did straighten up, but it broke more at the start. Oh, mm. just relax. So that's a little lesson there. Yeah, we're done. Cool. I'll take so three par fours in a row. It's a par four. I think this one we just drive as far as we can, don't we? We hopefully don't go off the front. That's all right. Should be about a hundred odd to go. One hundred and four. Okay. Again into the wind. Missed the impact. Oh, that wasn't bad at all, was it? Inside a foot. Not really much pattern practice inside a foot, though. That gets us to three under. Five's a little bit round the corner. See if we can get it. 
Nah, I missed the impact. Keep going. Should have enough to clear that bunker though and get it on the fairway. Yep. Just lost a bit of distance, really. So 120 left, which is about a nine. Yeah, it's about a nine iron, isn't it? Oh, good shot. Let us have a look. Just on the front. Oh, that's two within two foot. You're not really learning much from two foot putts, are you? <laughs> Could have done with those going in, so I didn't mean to do that. Um, that's it, set up the front corner. So this is downwind. Bit of super backspin. In theory, give me a higher shot, the wind should carry it further. But I lose a bit on the bounce and the roll, but it's longer than yesterday. So 90 yards to go. Again, a little bit of wind. It's a little bit uphill. Great shot. See if we can get it close. Oh, it's about five foot this time. Perfect. Jumps for a birdie. So we're certainly getting our approach shots in the right region. But we're not learning a lot about the greens. So seven's the par three. It's a par three. Where's that pim? Sort of back left. Uh, a bit of side wind on this. Got the top spin. Oh, nice shot. Didn't allow quite enough of the wind and it ran on, I suppose that was the downhill aspect of it. Give ourselves a putt though. It's just a cheeky little double breaker. Breaks to the left. It probably does break a little bit left. But not much. There you go. Got the birdie. So that's six under. Four five to finish the first nine. Again, this is just about getting this up and round the corner if you can. Ah, oh, I missed it. Left or right? I'm gonna go left again. Might be safe. I had this yesterday. Missed left. Yeah, and it's such a wide fairway. So you better well play the power shot because there's no penalty for missing. So a little bit of wind. The top spin. Looks good. Oh. They like it. Just a bit short. It's a little eight footer. Oh, just died on me. That needed to be a touch firmer, I think. So we missed it. Parred it again. Yeah. It's a par five to finish the nine. Oh, nine. It's a par five. This is downwind. Can we give it the beans? I think we can give it the beans, can't we? So again, a bit of super backspin. Give it a bit of height. Let the wind grab it. Yeah, you lose on the roll though. So it could have got it further up. 180 to go. And it's a five iron in there. Good shot. Good. Good, good. Got a good bounce. Oh, just a bit much on it. It's a 10 foot putt back for an eagle. Not a bad putt to have. In she goes. Good eagle to finish it. So that's 8 under for the first 9. Not 
not going to complain about that. We two putted twice. Strangely enough, they were the pars. We one putted everything else. Didn't get any of our chips though. We had two really close ones, two inside, two foot. So, in with nine. Ten's the first. Going into the wind, so top swing to keep it low. Didn't get it all though. Oh, and he went about 280. So 92 left. Into the wind. Bit of right hand spray on it. Gonna be in the region though. Just off the green. Great fun to get a shortish chip. Teeny cups though, so these are hard. And by no means gimmies. Got one. Oh, just didn't have the power. It's always the mistake I make on those. Even It's a powerful. So 11. Again, we'll try and get the top spin on it. There we go. In theory, it gives you a lower flight. Let's you penetrate the wind better. That's not bad. So 96 to go. Bear the wind. Got the top spoon. Oh, well, that's all right. Roll with it. Go for the birdie. Mm, cross the slope, eight foot. Breaks to the right. Just about, just about. That gets us to nine. Par three next. Downwind, downhill. Not my favourite combination. Got the top spin. Oh, neat shot. Just wanted to land on the front edge. Yeah. Always, always going to go past unless you're going to play backspin on it. But you get 25 foot pop. Let's see if we can pop. So it's going to break a lot to start and then ease. And it was short. A bit more on that and it probably would have made it. So I've been under hitting my putts, haven't I, today? I need to hit them slightly harder. So still at nine under. 13 again. Just drive it as far as you can. That bunker's not really going to interfere. A slope means you can be pretty aggressive. To 45 to go. Bit of a crosswind. Difficult to judge because of the height. That's not bad. It's in the ballpark. Okay, that putt across the slope. Looks like it's topped up. It's going to be hard to miss this high. Ah, not enough pace. Not enough pace. Line was probably good if I hit it harder. Now the two pups, those two pups that kill you. So 14 again, just hit it as hard as we can. Okay, so 160 to go. Oh, good 
shot. Great shot. Champion. Well, that's not bad. And stop. Can you give me a pop that ten foot? Yeah. Perfect. Oh, for the eagle. Oh, look at that across the slope again. Sloping uphill. Breaking to the right. And it's probably harder than I think it is. Oh, I missed it high. But the pace was spot on, wasn't it? It was much harder than I thought it would be. Another two pop. It's this um it's this inward nine. That's what I've got to work on. It's a powerful. The outward nine, I think I'm fine. I've got some good strategies. And I've got the shots. Go! Oh, good shot. It's just coming back in. Too many two putts, too many misses. And you're the so 135 to go. <laughs> Missed it. Still going to get on the green there. It's just going to give me a interesting pup. It's a 30-footer. Looks like it's close up. It's probably slightly right. Get in the hole. Ah, oh, it's a putt. Let's get ourselves a 30 footer. Hole 16 is a par 3. So, a lot of crosswind, and we're on this interesting bit of the green. If you look at it, it's got a slope either way, so it's just going to roll away whichever side you land it. That is a nasty little pin position. So. I think I'd rather be right than left. Oh, good shot. I mean, given a choice. Still end up left and short. However, we've got a pop. Looks like it slopes up. In a break late. There you go. Pull the string at the end. Get it in. 12 under, 4 5 finish. Oh, it's a powerful. Nah, 17 other wins the other way here. And I've got no power shots left, which I didn't realise until I'd attempted the shot. Luckily, I still hit it. You get one pixel to do it with. Well, that's okay. It's 100 yards to go. Crosswind again. Pitching wedge in. A little bit uphill. Yes. Got the top spin. Yeah, just a bit short for pace. Oh, look at that pop. Looks like it slopes up. Breaking to the left. Super hard to judge these. Just got it. Yeah. So much higher than it feels like it should be. It's a 13 under. Last one. Oh, 18. It's a par five. Okay. It's an 18. Oh, I haven't got a power shot. Let's just remember that. Yes. Use them all up earlier. Oh, neat shot. Nice shot. Nice shot. Tidy was off. 212 to go. So it's a three, yeah, three iron into the green. Hit it and pray. See how far it goes. Got the top spoon. Masterful. We've got all of it. Oh, I actually overhit it in the end. But we're on the green. Amazing. So we've got an eagle, eagle. pup. Look at that. Sloping uphill. Breaking to the left. Actually did me for pace. Lime was pretty good. Pace that got me there. I needed much more pace because of the curve. Finish with the birdie though. Finish on 14. 
but yeah, it's around the turn, isn't it? 8 to 13 is where I need to do the work. Stats wise, obviously, I haven't set a score for that setup. Yeah, miss one foey, miss one green. It's not the challenge here. The fairways are really wide and forgiving. It's, it's position, it's getting yourself close. That's the trick. Hope you enjoyed that. Um, please like, share, and subscribe. Please leave me a comment. Please let me know if you've played the qualifier, what you scored. And I'll see you next time for a little bit more if you Biddy's Golf. Okay, great client. You did great.